Hi everyone, now that Google Meet attendance is up and running, I wanted to share with you a little hint that um, I was able to figure out thanks to my friend Caitlin Law at the junior high who asked me and I researched it for her. Um, she wanted to know if there was a way to alphabetize the um, spreadsheets that you get by last name. And at first I didn't think there was, but then I did some digging and I found out a way to do it. So when you receive your email, it's gonna look something like this. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna click on the preview, brings up your preview, and you're gonna open with Google Sheets. Now when you do that, it's gonna take a second and you'll see that the attendance report comes up and it's alphabetized by, um, or it's not alphabetized at all. It's just up there, right? Who was in there first? It's, I think it's by time. So the first thing you need to do is you're going to click on the B column, right click and insert one column to the left. Now I'm going to click on the A column. This is my name column. And when I do that, I'm then gonna go to data and down to split text to columns. Oops, sorry. Right click. All right, you ready? A column, data, split text to columns. There we go. Now, once I do that, you'll see I have a separator comes up. You could say detect automatically, but I know that my separator for this is a space. So I'm gonna click space. And what happens is it automatically separates the names. Now, just be careful if you have names that are hyphenated because that might mess things up a little bit. So you may have to change that. So now I have a spreadsheet where my names are separated. Now, if you don't know how to do filters, what you're gonna do is you're gonna highlight all the columns because you want all the data to stick together. And up here, you'll see we have a filter view. I'm just gonna click on filter view. And now I have these little like upside down pyramids. I am gonna click on the upside down pyramid on the last name filter and I'm gonna sort A to Z. From there, you can see it automatically sorted all of my names by last name and I am good to go. So if you have any questions about this, please let me know. Otherwise, um, have a great day.